I have real concerns about grammar schools. I've met too many people in my life of my age and older who were deeply scarred by uh, the 11 plus exam and by that, that, that kind of segregation. And I know that you're now going to follow up by asking me about newspaper reports about my own son's education. All I will say is that I live a charmed and privileged life, much more now than I ever did when I was a child. But people on the left have often had charmed and privileged, privileged lives. But what I do yeah, in politics... But the Tories will say that it's hypocritical well, because if you've chosen a selective well, path for your son, how can well, you then deprive what I w what a I w selective path for poorer people? Well, I mean, what I would say about that is that, you know, I live in a nice big house and eat nice food and my neighbours are homeless and go to food banks. Does that make me a hypocrite or does it make me someone who is trying to do best, not just for my own family, but for other people's families too? And this thing about, you know, selection... You know, if you've got money, you will always be all right. If you don't have money in this country, you are increasingly but, but not all right. One of the arguments about, 